What's up, y'all? This is 1028 Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. What's going on, y'all? I have been live from the bed for the last 20 videos. Y'all heard what I said? <laughs> 20 videos, 10 videos a day, okay? So let's get into it. Um, I do think that the more I post, the more they expose me. Um, so, you know, if there's any comments that's under my photos, that's a little challenging i'm just gonna delete them okay because i think with growth comes you know a new responsibility <laughs> all right scorpios let's get into it all right so we at september 3rd we three days and trying to be consistent okay shout out to dre um i am doing my little workout situation but it's at the home is that it's not outside because it's hot out there okay so scorpio let's jump into it let's see what's going on for my scorpios what's goody right out the gate beloved wisdom love is a choice you make every day so choose wisely okay so scorpio your beloved wisdom you do love someone you do and it's a choice you know a lot of people don't understand that they feel like oh you told me you love me you gotta love me you gotta do whatever i tell you to do no you know what i'm saying even with love as a parent you know love is love people be like nah it's not it's different no it's not you know you can love your child and allow them to go through situations so that they can learn on their own or you could be an overprotective parent and try your best to give them examples and really be involved overly instead of, you know, letting them have their own experiences to learn. You know what I mean? You got to fall back. So, beloved wisdom, love is a choice you make every day. So, choose wisely. Scorpio, you chose yourself, all right? Now, you could be in the midst of chaos because this girl house is a little, you know, she got books everywhere. And this person could be like this, you know, they could have chose not love you know you could have chose love it says awaken rebirth become conscientious stay aware and embrace the renewal of your essence okay so with one of you guys you followed your heart okay you chose love but maybe love didn't choose you back okay um but with beloved wisdom even if you did choose love love is not staying in something that's dysfunctional Love is not staying in something that is abusive because this is chaos. So whatever you are choosing, Scorpio, you know it don't even make logical sense, okay? And I ain't gonna lie to you because this is beloved wisdom. You have the wise, the wisdom to do something or you know, you know what I'm saying, that you shouldn't be involved in it, but you love the person. And love is unlogical, but you do need to clean your house up, okay? You do need to sort out your stuff especially if you've been reading books and doing a lot of stuff you need to clean up your area that virgo energy should be helping you do that well whoever this is if they did not choose love that could be why they're in chaos things are all over the place they need to wash clothes okay they may have like a human um laundry person on their bed which is basically all your laundry on your bed okay flight plan sometimes things fall apart for better things to come in so even though you love this person a lot and you feel like um they even feel like you give great wisdom um they're choosing not to engage okay you're choosing not to engage because of clutter i don't know if this is cluttering our relationship or just clutter in your life that you need to organize okay this also could be somebody who is a hoarder or lives with someone who is a hoarder okay this could be your mom that's a hoarder your dad you could live with your siblings but somebody is a hoarder and it's a lot okay we got flight plans sometimes things fall apart for better things to come together okay so whoever this is um you know things have fallen apart with this person you could love this you do beloved wisdom but you know what it takes for you to be loved and you know what it is what it looks like for healthy love but with flight plan you could be getting on a plane okay also when you get on this plane you could be asking this person if you could switch seats or you know you want the window seat or you don't want to be in the aisle or something so just know you got to tell me the fight is going to change because you're going to change seats, okay? So you love somebody, but things didn't go the way you planned it, so things changed, okay? Endure the quest. 
through struggle, build a stigma to uncover and stand by your truth, okay? So um, you are somebody who don't like to sweat. You're somebody who don't like to go outside. You will endure a quest, okay? But it just can't be a hot one. You see this nigga climbing the mountain in reverse, okay? It said hard climb. You ain't doing that shit, okay? You are not somebody who rock climbs or climbs mountains. You also could have a fear of heights tremendously, okay? It says moon dream dreamer. Love, illusions, even the darkest of corners, okay? With the moon here, all right? So what this is saying is that one of the moons just passed. I feel like it was Virgo new moon. But this person is a dreamer, okay? And um, love illu illuminates even the darkest corners. So you and this person do love each other, okay? But at the same time, you have shown light to your flaws. This person has shown light to your flaws and you shown light to their flaws as well okay y'all are going on a quest but i feel like you know it's a quest that both of y'all are going on and it's you you're going against the grain because this is in reverse okay so you and this man are going on a quest you and this woman because it could be girl on girl going on a quest i don't see man on man here i gotta be honest with you but we do have more time but <clears throat> the place in which you thought y'all were going to, y'all won't be meeting that destination right this minute, Scorpio. Okay, with Moon Dreamer, there's a lot more things that you got to do solo, do dolo by yourself. And you're going to endure this quest alone. So are they. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. There's a lot of y'all. This time apart will allow you to see things in a different light as well as they do. You know, life without you. There's a lot of things that are hidden too. It says shades of love past trauma leave scars take time to heal yourself so whoever this is they do have past traumas those scars really haven't been revealed to you or vice versa but you do need to you you it's been recognized to you and you do need to take a step back so that you could you know invest in yourself properly so that you know how to love someone else properly now you could also have like um really dark hair all right you also could be wearing a lot of black lately you need to work on that okay <laughs> Some of you guys could be really sad. You could be wondering why these things are happening to you. Isolation when you really want to be around somebody. But Spirit is telling you it is time for you to be isolated. You have to endure a quest that only you can endure. But the thing about it is you and your level are enduring on this quest. But y'all just doing it in different places at the same time. Okay. With flight plans, things are going to change. But y'all still going to come together. Even though things are taking a different turn. Both of y'all have really big dreams about your future. You know, uh, y'all could sing songs that boost your confidence, but it's really just, you know, the universe telling you this is the life that you're supposed to have. Okay, it says moon dreamer. So y'all both dream about a life that you want. Both of you guys really want to be happy. Okay, that's really the point. Two of you guys want to be happy. Y'all want to be together. And you want it to be healthy, okay? So um, after a separation, you want happiness, you want reflection, you want what your soul is searching for. Somebody feels like they found that. They found happiness. They found somebody they want to be together with. They, they found somebody that they want to reflect things off of each other, okay? And they feel like this is you. Ooh. But their issue is you are a queen bee, Okay, so somebody found all the characteristics and traits in somebody that they love, but you you real handsome, you look good, you you look like you come from royalty, and even if your family is not from royalty, you exude that you will have, distribute, and just you know live in royalty, and people can see that. They see how you're very confident, you're a very focused man, you're career driven, and even if you're a woman, you know, you're very secure, you're very confident, you're focused on your goals. And, and you're not going to let anything or anybody stand in your way. You have a plan and it is concrete and solid. So whoever this is, they really like you. They don't want separation from you. And they could be very intimidated, what you don't see coming. They could be very intimidated on how secure you are, confident and focused you are. I just, you know, I don't know about when people be like, you know, I like the girl, but she too fine. Or I like the nigga, but he too fine. I mean... With Queen B at the bottom of the deck, you know, you do need to be with somebody who's on your level, who is secure, confident, and, and career driven just as you don't don't lower your standards, even if you a dude. You know what I mean? I know Scorpio dudes, I don't know if y'all have that build a bear project energy. But to be real, be with somebody who's equally yoked like you because if you don't, 
they could try to destroy your character because they feel inferior by what you bring to the table. But whoever this is, they happy about you. You know what I'm saying? Even though y'all have endured a lot of things, also y'all have big dreams. Um, everything never goes the way y'all it seems with this flight plan. But beloved wisdom, love to choose. Love is a choice and you make it every day. You continue to choose to love this person every day. This person did this to you too because the strongest card is the most um, influential. Both of y'all mutually made each other happy and both, both of you guys definitely didn't want to detach from each other because y'all both mutually feel like you're a boss, you're a power couple, and you're very stable. When you see these cards, it doesn't mean that this person has helicopters and planes and stuff. It just means that this person on the outside looking in has a sound plan of a goal or purpose that they're working towards. And that means that they have a light at the end of the tunnel that they're working towards. On the way to the light, it is so dark, but you don't give a fuck because you see that light. Both of y'all see this light, okay? All right, so this person feels like you make them happy, you make them focused, you make them driven. What you do pushes them, what they do pushes you, and this person wants to be with you. Why are y'all not together? Oh, that was quick. Y'all are not together because this person living in the moment, this person is too concerned about what happens if they're with you in the moment. So somebody is psychoanalyzing, like, if I don't do this, this is gonna be bad. If I don't have this, this is gonna be bad. Living in the moment, this person be doing other shit outside of your ass, okay? Yeah, this person also reminisces on the memories, okay? But they do want to make memories in current time. Living in the moment, they living in the past. So the reason why this person ain't with you is because they living in the past. They holding on to past hurt, okay? And <clears throat> work fair affair. It has been revealed, okay, that this person has been doing something more on the job than they may have led on, okay, with work fair fair, but it's in reverse. So this person didn't have it have sex at work. Either this person did have sex at work, or it's been revealed that this person had sex at work. Living in the moment means this person stay living in the past, all right, and with memories here in reverse, okay. Uh, somebody keeps bringing up the past. So this person could be a previous cheater or they just have a long-standing relationship with someone that's not really a relationship, but could be a situationship. Um, yeah, we also have fake news. So somebody could be telling you, oh, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant. Okay, but they lying, they ain't pregnant. <laughs> okay, so be careful with that, um, with this fake news. So somebody could be telling a man that they pregnant just so they can... You know what I mean? Like get attention from them or, you know, one-on-one -on -one treatment. But in a, in actuality, it's fake. You know what I'm saying? So you ain't got to, you do need to be nice. Like men who be out here having sex with people with no condom on and then treating them like shit because you don't want to get pregnant with them. I hope you receive what you get, you know? Uh, you at least need to be nice to her ass until she get an abortion and then you need to let it go. But some of y'all will be nice to her until she handles whatever she has to handle and then go back and have sex with her, get her pregnant again. And then the second time when she don't want to have the abortion, you mad at her. It's like, why are you guys as males going back to these females if you don't want a baby just because it's raw? Do not do that. If you're de dealing with somebody and you slip up and God let you get out of that, don't do it again and then treat this woman like shit and vice versa, okay? Pregnancy test and fake news. Stop fucking this nigga raw if he can't make a commitment to you, all right? But whoever this is, this person could be juggling more than one woman or more than one man, okay? Because with fake news and pregnancy, somebody is going to do something to get someone else's attention. How does this person feel about this fake pregnancy, girl? I fantasize about, okay, so whoever this is, they fantasize about somebody else. This is sideways. That's not pregnant. It says, I want to apologize. I needed your forgiveness in reverse, okay? So somebody wanted attention, love, just like somebody just to show that they gave a fuck. That, that nigga did, still didn't give a fuck, whoever this was. It says, I regret what I did to you in reverse, okay? So they don't really regret what they did to you. That's how they move, okay? But they fantasize about another woman, okay? Or another man. I'm on my way to you. So somebody unexpectedly could be like popping up at your house or wanting to come towards you, Scorpio, okay? But this is after they left somebody else, all right? That was, you know, doing too much. This person also could have purchased some white tennis shoes recently, Um Somebody don't regret walking off on somebody. Somebody is very chaotic 
and they just feel like they just need to dip out on this person. But long story short, <clears throat> you need to choose wisely in love. You have a lot of wisdom, Scorpio, and just because you love somebody don't mean you got to be with them. Some people will use our love as a way to, you know, manipulate and anchor in, but I feel like you're very wise, okay? But I do feel like it's time to clean the fuck up, okay? Because somebody is very messy, and you need to put some organization to this. I love you guys, and let's make September 3rd great. Bye. Scorpios is really private, but will sting if you get close. And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined, then don't go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. They appreciate the ones they love, they ain't worth the fake shit. They don't really like people switching up, and they can be kinda controlling, like, bitch. Shut the fuck up Shut Scorpios up. are leaders and they always think ahead And they also open minded so you gotta give them credit give them. If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy They also like a meal so in the kitchen all you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip And they do not disappoint man, you just gotta tap in Tagging shit this video to a Scorpio you